Based on this data, various ads are loaded onto your smartphone. Personally, I think few people like ads because they're distracting. So why would you really need such a nasty thing on your smartphone that monitors what you do on your home screen? Just so you understand, your home screen is the screens you see on your smartphone. So, here's one home screen. If I switch, it's a different home screen. So, in reality, you could have many home screens on your phone, depending on how many you create for personal use. So, it's a built-in, comprehensive system program that can monitor and control what you do on your desktop. It can move apps, install them on the desktop itself, and much more. But that's not what I'm talking about now. I'm going to talk about a well-hidden setting that's best left disabled. I'll tell you everything now. Be sure to give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, and share with your friends. So, where is this hidden desktop button? If you go to the standard settings, no matter what phone model you have, you'll find a line in this standard list that's responsible specifically for the desktop. If you can't find it, at least look for an icon like a house. As a last resort, if you still can't find it in the standard settings, I recommend using the standard settings. Click on search and simply type the word desktop here. Actually, you don't even have to type it in full. And so, looking at the little house, we can already see that this is the setting. Click on it and, basically, we'll get to where we need to go. Now, regarding this whole menu. Yes, it may differ slightly on different smartphones. Some functions may simply be misplaced. Personally, on mine, it's at the very end. Scroll through and look through all the settings if you don't find this button at the end called Show Recommendations. But in my case, that's what it's called on this phone specifically. But if you translate the interface into other languages, this button might be called Show Ads or Show Offers. They're the same thing. So, your home screen might download ads based on what you do on your smartphone. Of course, remove this button and this slider and you'll be happy that you've improved your smartphone. It will use less of your RAM. This will also have a positive impact on your smartphone's battery life. And in general, there will be less advertising that constantly appears at inconvenient times for you. 